Hello everybody, welcome to Experiment P16. We don't usually start these videos this way, we usually just kind of give you a little teaser and jump straight into the content for the week. Um, but this is a little different, so this is our 10th weekly vlog, um, and we've had a lot of fun filming it. Um, we've had uh, a great appreciation for you guys watching it, um, and all the feedback and stuff you've given us, um, you know, in passing and through the videos and Instagram and whatnot, so... We wanted to give you guys a little reward and a surprise so um to say thank you um and because we are so close to uh 250 subscribers which doesn't seem like a lot but to us you know for somebody who started you know we started this channel expecting very little and and it's it's grown to what it is now so we love it um because we are so close to 250 subscribers, once we get there, so make sure that you, if you haven't, you've subscribed. Um, once we get to 250, we are going to be doing a giveaway. And we are going to be giving away a Experiment P16 logo t-shirt. Um, and there might be a few other little goodies thrown in there as well. So make sure you enter because until you win, you won't know what you get. But yeah, we just wanted to say thank you for all of the support. And good luck. Good morning, everybody, and welcome to week 10 of our weekly vlogs. And this morning, me and Jack are going to play with some Play Doh. You ready, Jack? Yeah. You want to pick a color? Pink. You want to use pink first? Right, let's use pink. Pink and, 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 and green. Pink and green? Excellent choice. So you want a pink and green, yeah? Yeah. I don't know what the heck that's one. Oh, look, you can still see the gingerbread man, kind of, that we used when we last played this. There you go. There's your pink. <laughs> hey, let me get it out for you. Daddy. Yeah, look, I'll help you. And then you remember how to get it out? Maybe Daddy doesn't know how. Yeah. Ah. Yeah. yeah. Daddy, you want to use white? You want to use white too? Daddy, no, you're going to use white. Wait a second. That's not white. <laughs> That's orange. Oh. Daddy. Yeah. I told you. You told me. So does this mean this is blue? No, there's the white. I mean, Dad. there's a little bit of blue in it. Daddy. All right, what are we going to make first? I make this one, this one, and this one. Are we going to make a star? I to make all colors. All colors. So we've got a star. We've got a butterfly. We've got... Scissors to cut them with. What else have we got? We've got a cloud. We've got a rainbow. We've got a circle. We've got a butterfly. No, that's ginger man. Oh, that's, that's a gingerbread man. Sorry. We've got a triangle. But that's a butterfly. That's a butterfly. Yeah. Okay, so. Oh, we'll get that one in a second. Which one do you want to pick? I'm what color? Pink. I have blue. Blue? Yeah. What oh, blue's here? No, that's not blue. This is blue. Thank there you, you go. Now, which cutter do you want to use? Um, all of them. You want to use them all? You have to pick one. Um, you want to do a star or a butterfly? I want to have them. Yeah, I know, but which one do you want to use to cut? You want to use um, butterfly? Yeah. Okay, what color? This one. Blue. Right, so remember yeah. what we'll have to do? We'll have to flatten it out. Okay. We'll have to flatten it. Like this. Daddy. And then when we'll put it down, you put the butterfly in the middle okay. and push down hard. Okay. All right, go on. Okay. Push down really hard. Good boy. Yeah, good boy. Remember, wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Look 
wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Yay. Wow. Can I take it out? Yeah. You want to use the cutter? Yeah. Let's get no, them out. No, you want to use the scissors? No, you use I'll use the scissors. scissors. All right, ready? So then let's no. cut them out. So then... No. Oh, I don't need to. Look, it just popped out. Oh, wow. Ah. So now we've got a butterfly. No, no screen first. Okay, should we do a green triangle? Oh. A green... And who's this? Green triangle, excellent choice. It's almost like I chose it myself. Daddy. Yeah. News. And right. then this here. So we'll do that, and then you do the triangle in the middle. Other way, other way, other way. Did you use the handles to push down? Arch. Daddy. That's right. So that goes like that. Yeah, yeah you do it. Wiggle, 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 remember, push it down wiggle, hard. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Wow. And there's your triangle. No, well, I'm triangle. Yeah, that's good. You did well saying that, dude. Well done. All right, I'm going to do a white cloud, okay? Daddy, no, you use well, we this could do, one. You want me to use that one instead? Yeah. Okay, well, I'm going to use a different color then. I'm going to use red for that one. Oh, pink. All right. No, mommy, <clears throat> no, <it's> pink. <laughs> no, cut your, oh, cut All your. right, here we go. Ready? Right in the middle. Take your wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. And now we've got a red circle, too. So Jack just informed me that he has a roller, and I think I know what's coming next. Okay, go on. We're gonna flatten them. No, I'm making them. <laughs> I'm making a brine. Well, the butterfly lasted long, didn't he? I just Okay. <laughs> <laughs> happy friday everybody made it to another weekend um it's work done till monday um not sure what the weather forecast is this weekend but if it's dry and not windy i would like to try and get the drone up at some point so i might stick some footage in if we manage it but uh yeah let's see what happens also just got home got changed had a bike deed Oh yes, it's that time again. Wow. Just wow. So Jordan's days would sound like dogs. Yeah, say exterminate. Exterminate. Yep, it's ex I, I'm not even kidding. Pierre put a clip of exterminate from an actual Dalek next to that. Exterminate. <laughs> so I just got home. I'm about to get changed. I'm about to have a bite to eat. However, there's one more thing tonight. It's time for the series finale of WandaVision. I have stayed off social media all day. I have kept away from people who I know have watched it. It's time to see what happens. This is gonna either be amazing or terrible. And I think it's gonna be amazing. Well, here goes nothing. See you on the other side. Well, that's the end of the actual episode. It was unbelievable. There's got to be some form of end credit scenes, though. It's not over yet. There's got to be another one. I'm just waiting. They've done what they usually do when you go to the cinema. I'm gonna wait until this goes back to Disney Plus before I rule my judgment on this. But I think they may have been talking about Nick Fury there in that first one.
Good morning and a very happy Saturday. Doesn't a nice weather always make you feel good? It's absolutely beautiful outside again. Hopefully this is in for the weekend. Got a couple of jobs to do this morning. And then later on today we bought a, um, like a treehouse type playhouse type thing for uh, Amelia. And uh, I might put that up in the garden. <laughs> I think our trainers might be a bit too heavy for her. <laughs> even worse than Just out for a little walk around our hometown. Amelia! So it's quite a handy little cycle track, so Amelia, Amelia, cyclists use Amelia. it. Amelia, this um, but it marks a nice kind of walk around, around the town. Funny, I thought hairdressers weren't open until the 16th of April. <laughs> You're doing such a good job. She's very gentle. She is very gentle. Donna, come here! Marco! <laughs> Thanks. Oh, so pretty. Good morning, welcome back. Sunday the 7th of March today. And uh, Amelia's here, as you can probably hear. So, probably going to try and get out and go for a walk somewhere today. It's, it's dry, it's a bit grey and overcast, but... Other than that, yeah, it doesn't seem too bad. It wasn't too cold yesterday. We had a walk around Cromlington, so. Oh, the joys of having a granddaughter. So I was making a bowl of cereal this morning and I poured the uh, frosted flakes into the bowl and this came out. <laughs> that is the biggest frosted flake I've ever seen. Jack, you want it? Is it good? Yeah, tasty. Tasty. Just made myself a little snack. Um, Kayla bought these a while ago and we've tried the flaming Hot Cheetos one, um, but it was a bit too spicy. We ended up sending those to Rachel because she loves spicy uh, Cheetos. But yeah, when I popped this open, it smelled exactly like a bag of Cheetos. Um, it tastes really good, but I've just been saying to uh, Pierre, because they're on the camera right there. Say hi, hi guys. Hi, um, it's missing some crunch. That's the only thing I would say. It needs something. Um, I think I'm just used to like baked mac and cheese with like breadcrumbs and stuff on that. I need a crunch. Um, but it's still good. And to wash down this delightful snack, we're finally going to have this. This has been chilling in the fridge since we went to the British store and it's time. Popping the cap and smelling it just brings back every memory ever. And do you know what I wish I could have and they'll vouch for it is, um, can you remember those iron brew, um, they were like the hard candies, they were like, it was kind of like a refresher. Um, yeah. That smell, here we go. This is uh, for more of the adult uh, viewers of the channel. I used to drink this with um, vodka. <laughs> I used to go out and that just made more memories come back. So, oh dear. That's it. We've officially had enough of the snow. So we've decided to make it summer. I'm gonna have burgers and hot dogs on the grill. There's my hot dog. I'm ready to go. Mm. Annie just told me to come out and get a video of this, so it must be good. Yeah, that definitely does not disappoint. <laughs> I wish you could smell this through the camera, because my God. <laughs> oh my goodness. Well, the hot dog was absolutely incredible, so now it's time to try the burger. And I know this is gonna be good because Annie makes incredible burgers, so. Mmm, yeah, it's perfect. And I made, I made homemade uh, Big Mac sauce to go on it. So, mwah, perfect. Well, good evening, everybody. Monday, the 8th of March. Um, just got home, 
got changed, had a bite to eat. Uh, best laid plans, I was on my way home from work and I thought it's looking quite nice outside, it's bright. Um, sunset maybe an hour away. So I'm thinking, yeah, I had a location in my mind. I'm thinking, yep, yeah, I can get home, get changed, get, get me dinner sorted. Uh, grab the camera gear, get out. Location was local. I'll get out, get a couple of pictures taken. I was going to bring you guys along with us, but um, I got home and we had a major um, tumble dryer malfunction. So I've just spent the last 20 minutes trying to put that right. So now it's dark. And then maybe tomorrow. Hello, everybody. Just got home from work and I'm about to have a bite to eat, but this one's a little bit different. Um, Kayla bought some stuff for me to do a taste test later. So I decided if I'm going to be bad again today, and I promise I will get back on the diet, but I'm going to be bad again tonight. So stopped at McDonald's to get the new crispy chicken sandwich that is supposedly the best chicken sandwich uh, fast food has to offer. So we're going to give it a go and see if it uh, matches up. To me, Chick-fil-A is probably the best one, uh, but I don't know if this is going to be uh, as good as Chick-fil-A. So I did already remove the pickles, but in doing so, I realized that this actually comes with nothing on it at all. No sauce, nothing. Now, I knew there was going to be no cheese, but I was expecting like a little bit of mayonnaise or something. So we're just going to have to try it dry and let's give it a go. It's nice, but it needs sauce. That's the only thing I'll say. Um, I've actually got a bottle of uh, Chick-fil-A sauce uh, in the fridge that Kayla got me for Christmas and I'm probably going to put that on it because that's what it needs. It just needs something else. Um, whether that have been cheese, sauce, um, but I'm going to go with sauce. So I'll give it a, I'll give it a 7 out of 10. Um, if it had had sauce, it probably would have been closer to a 9. Um, but that bun is really good though. That's better. So, this came today, and I'm gonna open it because I actually ordered, well, I bought um, Taylor's Xbox, my future brother-in-law, um, and they sent it to me, but I got told apparently that there's something else in here uh, for us. So we're gonna open it up and see what, uh, what Yvonne put in here. Let's have a look. Hopefully some goodies. Well, you know what she's like. Although the last time she sent stuff that ruined my diet. So maybe this will be like fruit to get me back on it. Right. You also... I'm like, I'm looking at it going. What's in the box, Why Jordan? is there towels in the box? I'm about to go, Yvonne wrapped them really bad. What's in the box? Where's, did the real one come? What's in the box? What? Oh, he's got two oh. stones. Well, <laughs> it's definitely not an Xbox. It's definitely not an Xbox. <laughs> Did the real one come or not? <laughs> yeah. It's in here. He nearly took the label off of that box. It peeled it off and I told your mother and father. Hell. And that's when your father texted you and said, record it and do an unboxing. Because he knew there was rocks in here. I said, Jordan gave me because wow. I was behind Kayla. I said, yeah, I'm wow. Jordan, he's getting a wow. box of rocks. Pierre's going to have to put a lot of wows over the top of that speech. <laughs> Oh, that was the one. <laughs> oh, I literally said in the car as well. Uh, so when we're in the car earlier, um, I said to Kayla, uh, when we found out that the package was at the top of the stairs and her mum said that she was going in downstairs, I was like, what, so she can't bring the box in? Like, there's an Xbox just sat on the, you know, on the top of the stairs. Why can't you bring it in? Now I know why. <laughs> Oh my goodness. <laughs>
<laughs> that was good. I'll be honest. <laughs> I'm not even. I can't express. I can't wait to watch that back. I can't express my confusion when I opened this and saw two towels. I'm like, they wrapped it up in towels. I don't. What's in this? Soil. <laughs> I, I love how confidently I was just like doing this with the like you know what I mean just like slicing it up and like yeah I'm getting an Xbox now this is great and then I was two bath towels in it and two stones and two stones hey the weight was good I'll be honest that was good yeah the first rock I put in there was too heavy. <laughs> I still don't believe it. If you, until I open if you slice thing. right there, it will open up like that up top. Right there. Yeah. I'm scared to open the actual Xbox in case there's like, you know, not an Xbox inside of it. And you've... Uh, uh, don't be nothing. Oh, I saw that and thought that was more towels then. Alright, so. Is it something for Cheryl in there? Yes, there's a few different things. So she did send some goodies. So I'm assuming this is for me because obviously it matches my eyes. Um. Well, these are the things that my mum mentioned wipes. to you. Yeah. yeah. So there's them. And then there's this, which we have one of these each. Uh, we have one upstairs and we have one downstairs. Uh, that um, Yvonne made, my mum. And she made this for... Um, I'm just trying to get the things out of the way. Oh, that's going to be an issue. We'll have to try and fix that. But she made one for one of Annie's friends. And it's a Scrabble uh, name board, so there's one letter kind of stuck over one of the names, so we'll have to try and uh, fix that, but it looks really, really good. Um, she does a really good job with that. Then these are all mine. Maltesers teasers. And it's because they're like the truffles, and I love the truffles. And then what else have we got in here? So we have... A book for Jack called Jack the Superhero. Look at that, dude. Daddy. You like it? No. Oh, okay. Well, I guess <laughs> I'll have it then. Um, <laughs> put that up there. And then I don't know what this is. Oh, it's a nice shirt for me. Maybe I'll wear that tonight, Kayla. You know. Looks nice. Very, very nice. Oh, there's more. <gasps> Super Mario undies for Jack. No, they're Nana's. They're Nana's. These won't fit Nana. These are baby boy undies. Oh. <gasps> and we've got something else for Jack too. New pajamas. Wow. Wow. Jack, look, who's that on there? Who is that? Spider-Man. Yeah. Daddy. Spider-Man PJs. And then the piece de resistance. My Xbox. And the main reason that I ordered this. Well, I see, keep saying ordered, that I bought this uh, off Taylor was because it is physically impossible to buy one of these over in uh, the US right now. Uh, me and Kayla went to GameStop and they turned around and said that if we managed to find one new, uh, they'd be very surprised and that all of the pre-owned uh, like versions of it have been bought up. Um, which is crazy considering that you can't buy one of the new versions anywhere, so... Can't wait to get this set up. Thanks guys. So we're having a mommy and daddy night out tonight. Uh, we've come to Casa Tequila again because it's incredible. Uh, we've got some chips and salsa to start. Kayla got, what was this called? This is coconut pineapple margarita with a sugar rim. And then I got a frozen strawberry margarita with a sugar rim. And then we know uh, one of the people that works here and she was nice enough to bring us over 
a shot of tequila each. And if it tastes like it smells, it's gonna be tough to get down. It's really good. Happy Tuesday, everybody. Welcome back. Um, got home, had a bite to eat, got changed in that specific order. A little bit of a switch around tonight. Um, yeah, so we uh, had a nice comment from uh, one of our subscribers um, on last week's vlog today asking for some photography um, segments. So uh, we'll try and stick that in at some point this week. If not tonight, yeah, we'll see. I might have to wait until the weekend. Uh, but yeah, we'll see what we can do. Anybody else has any, re any requests for stuff like that, then... Yeah, by all means, leave a comment down below, and we'll uh, we'll see what we can do for you. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Happy Wednesday hump day in America as usual got home had a bite to eat got changed just gonna sit down and have a quick squint through YouTube see if there's anything I've missed uh, any of the weeklies and daily stuff that I normally watch um, don't know if you can hear that music in the background it's uh, Lee downstairs strumming away not sure whether it's uh, copyrighted so I'm just gonna keep talking over the top of it <laughs> I don't know whether it's his own composition because he's been writing a few tunes re uh, lately a few of his own uh, bits of stuff so we may get that up on um, get that up on his channel I've, I'm trying to talk him into recording something so that we can do a like a music video that'll be interesting might do some behind the scenes on this channel but when he does it it'll be obviously uh, released on on his own channel um, and we will link that as and when it uh, it gets up and running but uh yeah so there we go it's time to be healthy again just added some of my mother-in-law's homemade pasta sauce it's so good i'm gonna put a little bit of cheese in this ready to eat all right maybe i can get into this healthy eating because this smells absolutely phenomenal if it tastes as good as it smells this is going to be a great dinner welcome back thursday last day of the week for the weekly vlog i'm not sure what's happening tonight probably the usual uh, but tomorrow as you all know by now we finish early on friday so see what we can get up to in the afternoon but for now You'll obviously won't see that until next week's vlog. Um, for now, just going to check out a bit of YouTube, see if there's anything on there that I've missed this week. Um, just catch up with the regulars. Sitting here watching Peter McKinnon at the minute. And he's going through a big purge and clearing out some of his gear. And I can't help think I probably need to do the same thing. Probably nowhere near on the scale that he's got, but just watching him makes you sit back and think, you know, what stuff you've got lying around that you don't actually use, and it could be serving a purpose somewhere else. Having said that, the plan is, when we eventually get back out to America, so I need to take some of this stuff anyway and give it to Jordan, just to try and help him up his game, stop him from filming on that stupid bloody iPhone. I joke. I do like the iPhone, and the quality is pretty good, but in low light, You've seen some of his footage in his weekly vlogs. It's not the best, is it? But then a lot of that could be down to the user. Maybe that's another vlog or a segment in itself. I'll see what... Um, maybe I should vlog on my iPhone. And we'll do a comparison of the footage. You're interested? Comment down below. Another thing that's just dawned on me is... That's the last day of week 10. 70 days. 
recording something. I know it hasn't always been the best content, but actually sticking to something for 70 days is just unheard of for me. Well, other than when I've done the gym. I did the gym for two years, every day. Uh, didn't get anywhere, <laughs> but still, I did it, I stuck with it, so. Something else I've just noticed, again, because I heard the clatter last night and I've uh, just realised that um, my sign is down. So that's not good. So I need to uh, find some way of fixing that back up there. But first I think I need some coffee. Really need to work on the consistency of the milk. I think that's what's letting us down at the minute. So I've tried to clean off the glue that was holding on the magnet which holds on the metal sign. That's about as good as I can get it so I'm going to try and stick the new stick it back down over here and then just go slightly lower with the sign on the door. So I've got some uh, normal double sided tape. I'm going to try that this time just see whether it sticks any better. That's documented. 20 to 9, Thursday the 11th of March. Let's see how long it lasts. I'll try and remember when it collapses and falls off to uh, record that as well. Guess what? It's not Friday. It's Thursday. And to prove it, it's dark outside. There's a first for everything. I managed to get in and remember to film the outro up here. You'll be very happy and very proud. Um, just wanted to say thank you everybody for watching. Um, don't forget uh, to enter the giveaway that we've got going on Instagram and on Facebook right now. Um, it's going to go on for a week and then we're going to announce the winner. Um, and I just want to say thank you to everyone who has um, subscribed uh recently and you know supported the channel it, it really does mean a lot to us uh that you guys take the time out to watch this stuff so um yeah thank you again um don't forget if you haven't to subscribe um leave a like and a comment uh just to let us know uh how you're enjoying it um and also don't forget to ring that bell this one, that's where you need to put up here. Um, just so you don't miss any of the future videos. Oh, he's not gonna be happy with that one. Um, there's nothing else really to say. Thank you again for watching guys, and we'll see you in the next one. Cheers.